Hello everyone, Diane here and I have a Dollar Tree haul. I am in shorts, it's a really hot day, it's gonna be 90 today. So maybe I'll do the haul from over here a little bit so you guys can see my body. Um, okay, I have a Dollar Tree haul and a couple other things I wanna show you. So the first thing I got is these were in the Halloween section. I usually get forks, knives, and spoons there a lot of times, but these were orange for Halloween. I thought they were nice. I've never seen orange ones before. They do have colored ones like for parties, but I thought these were really nice. So I got these. Then I already got into this. This is white, choc white cream Kit Kats with like a white chocolate. I don't think it's real white chocolate, but um, instead of milk chocolate, I love it. It's the same inside, I think. So Kit Kat, I already got into this and ate it. It was in the Halloween section, but I think they might have Kit Kat just all the time. Then I got these, which are like, um, gosh, what are they like? Cheez-Its. They're called Cheez-Alicious and they're crackers. Those like cheese crackers. They're really good just for a little snack to fill me up. If I'm like hungry in between meals, I'll just have a few of these. I think there's some protein because there's cheese in them, but probably not a lot if you just eat a few. Then this is the reason my mom and I went there, if you saw my last video, is to get date books. They only had ones with bent covers like this, and they were out of any good ones. Usually when I go to get them, there's some good ones and some bad ones but that are wrinkly, but hopefully this will settle out. My mom got a pink one. They had all different colors. They had like five colors. As you can see, it gives room for each day, Monday through Friday, Sunday through, Monday through Sunday on, on each page. And it goes through the whole year of uh, 2023 weekly planner. So everything I bought is $1.25. It used to be a dollar, but now it's $1.25. So I got that. And I did buy this at a different Dollar Tree. We had to go to two Dollar Trees, which is why we didn't go to a restaurant. We ended up driving through Burger King on the way home because I was tired. I had to drive a half an hour to each Dollar Tree through traffic. I don't live real close to a Dollar Tree, so it was just, and the traffic was really bad. There was a street closure for like several blocks. We had to take a detour and it took us way out of our way on Van Nuys Boulevard, which has a lot of traffic. But I got this just in case the other Dollar Tree didn't have what I just showed you, that light blue book. And this is a two-year planner horses I got. They had different ones. And you can write things in each box, but it's real tiny for each day. So it's for two years. So the good thing is, is I'm already making appointments for January. So right now I've already made an appointment in my book to go get a lab test in, in the new year, I think it's in April, to go get an um, HbA1c to see if my diabetes is still under control with no medication. So I got, I can use this like in December when I start making appointments for the following year, I can use this next year. Or I'll just toss it, it was only $1.25. I'll give it to someone. Then my mom gave me this picture of us that I have on my phone. It's us in the car. And um, I ended up um, buying a frame for it. So this is the frame. And I didn't know this, but it's for dogs. It's for your pets because it's got right here, it's got paws, two paws. Looks like a dog, but I thought it was pretty being silver and kind of sparkly and only 125 for a four by six, pretty good. So all the frames were 125 actually. They had ones for diplomas, they had all kinds. So that, then I bought this soap. I usually get like the yellowish gold soap by pairs. In fact, I take it over when I go on vacation because I don't like using the soaps that most people have that have um, tallowate in it, which is sodium tallowate, which is, I believe, animal fat. They're not ve vegan or vegetarian. So I get um, like milk soaps, as long as they're not made with animal flesh, I'll, I'll have them, but, um, or tallowate. Like if it's just vegetables soap with some milk, I used to buy those. But if it's completely, um, I probably wouldn't now, but um, this is a glycerin soap, but it has other things in it. It's like a glycerin soap, but this one's mint flavored. The other one, I don't know what flavor it is, 
but this is mint and it should be good. Let me see what it says. Mint extract, yes. You can't smell it through because it's wrapped in plastic. But I take this when I when I go to hotels, when I go spend the night at someone's house or whatever, because I don't know if their soap is vegetarian or not, or vegan. Then I got some cotton candy that I haven't eaten yet. You'll be proud of me. It's birthday cake flavored. I love cotton candy of any flavor and I like to get it like at Disneyland and stuff, though I haven't had it in a long time. So this is um, birthday cake or amusement parks. And fun fair, keeping it sweet with a little treat. So that's good, I got that. Then I got two pairs of sunglasses. Now these are ones you could find at Venice Beach where they sell a lot of sunglasses near me in, in LA County, but these are only 125. No, I got white to wear with a white outfit, like white t-shirts. And they're both kind of in the same style, like a Wayfarer type style. They're unisex, it says on the, um, on the receipt. And then I got these that are like a turquoise or a bluish color, but they're tortoise shell. These are a little different shape. They're not the same. And they've got tortoise shell on the sides. I haven't taken the labels off them yet but I like these a lot. So I got two new pairs of sunglasses. I have a lot of sunglasses, but most of them are like $10 at Venice Beach, $8, whatever. So, and then I wanna show you two other, one other thing. Actually, I showed you the photo. I wanna show you one other thing, and that's this Pusheen plush that I've had, I just found it. I forgot to display it, but it has um, the cute Pusheen whiskers and the face and the stripes on the back and the striped tail, and it even has feet. It's so cute. And it matches, it matches my other Pusheen, as you can see. So, um, yeah, I keep those on my couch. They're so cute together, the same color. So let me make another video from back here to show you I'm in shorts. So, um, what else? Did I show you the Staffy Duck? I don't know if I did. It's a cute Daffy Duck. But anyways, um, what else? Oh, I'm going to be doing a live stream soon. So please come on my live stream. Say hi or watch if you, if you want to lurk. That's fine. But um, I hope you'll come on. It's probably going to be in the afternoon one day or maybe around now. I think it's around. What time is it? I can't tell. I think it's around um, 11.30 or 12. I think it's around 12 noon or 11.30 p.m. a.m. So that's it. I might make it around one or two, my, my live stream. So again, I'm in shorts, as you can see. And here's my outfit. They're white shorts with black streaks, as you can see. So that's it, and it's gonna be, I'm wearing shorts because it's gonna be 89 today. But it's really nice because it's it's cooling down to the 60s at night. Like, I think it was 63 last night or 62, so it's I don't need air conditioning because it's cooling down enough at night. I can go without air conditioning in the afternoon. So, and usually in the summer, it just gets into the se high 70s at night a lot of times, and you need air conditioner all the time. So, when it gets hot like 90 something, but since it's cooling down low at night, I don't, I don't use it, save money. So thanks for watching, comment, rate, subscribe, and that's it, bye.